thinking through it, and I honestly, I mean, for me, we we built this program on NIL. We really did, and and I, it's probably different than what you're thinking, though. We we built this program uh, in God's name, image, and likeness, and that's how I look at it. So, okay, Dabo, I, I guess well, I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, Jackson State had a great first day. Now, the early sounding period runs from today to Friday. Jackson State has landed skilled players. Skilled position players, they got that in abundance. But if you watch the Celebration Bowl, uh, North Carolina Central ran all through Jackson State's defensive line. So I hope in the next couple of days they can get some offense alignment and some defense alignment. This football player in the image, his name is Isaiah Kendall, three-star wide receiver with crazy talent. Now, like I said, Jackson State has skilled position players. Jackson State, they did get a linebacker from Louisiana Tech. He didn't do much in college, but he got possibly three years left. About 230 pounds. He can add depth, but I need, in the next couple of days, I need to see some old linemen come come through, through the transfer portal. From the junior college ranks, from high school, they got to get that old line right. They got to get that D line even more stout. Games are one in the trenches. We all know that. And since I'm talking about the trenches, Gramlin landed a transfer. From Arizona, a lineman by, by the name of Chantrell. He's, he's over 300 pounds. Southern, they landed a defensive lineman from Arkansas State. Darius Jackson, he's 6'2", 320 pounds. So, yeah, I need to see Jackson State go ahead and get some D lineman, offensive lineman in the early signing period. Sure, they, they own it. They're going to make it happen. Now, fam, you, they got a transfer running back from Nebraska by the name of Jaquez Yant, 6'2", 236 pounds. So all these teams, now I'm going to be on there heavy for the next couple of days. Just giving y'all sports news. So I'm going to talk to these guys later. Let's go on to sports night. What's good, job? What's going on? It's Corner Sports Network. Do not forget to like, share, and comment. Uh, you hear me? Uh, so. Can you hear me? Uh, you want Alabama? Celebration there with you and your family and your friends, your yeah. classmates. Why? Tell us both. Why Alabama? Why did the Tide win the day here? Just to win the tradition. Um, over the years, uh, we just know we're gonna go there. We're gonna get pushed hard, and hopefully be a legend. Yeah. James. Yeah, I mean, I chose school because I have a great relationship with the coaches, and it felt like home to me. And uh, just go be great and win. to the University of Michigan.
said, I've been taking the next three to four years of my career to the University of Michigan.